world. This is Bram here with DMDS. We're here at the Juno announcement press conference here to see which Canadian artists are nominated for some Junos. So why don't we head upstairs and check that out. The nominees for Album of the Year, sponsored by Music Canada, are Kiss, Carly Rae Jepsen, Songs Atoned, Celine Dion, Storms, Headley, Believe, Justin Bieber, and ever after, Marianne's Trench. And given the abundance of talent in this year's field of nominees, it's kind of hard to predict uh, how things will play out in Regina and Moose Jaw in April, but I hope to see all of you out there celebrating our talented artists for Canada's Music Awards. We got a lot to say and a lot of people to talk to, so let's do it right now. media distribution company we uh, distribute albums and music videos uh, okay. for you know lesser known artists as well as everyone here that yep. most of their albums have been distributed okay. do you have any advice for you know even children that are yeah. looking to get in the music industry and and get noticed that you have any yeah. advice for them I do um, the first thing is hone your craft have a passion for what you do believe in what you do be true to it um, and then have a vision and follow it do you guys have any advice for someone looking to get into the industry looking to get their video noticed uh, online or, or anywhere else. Do you guys have any advice? Oh, if you want, if you want to uh, get noticed, have have Eric Alper retweet something that you tweeted. <laughs> social media That's definitely it. helps. That's it. No, but social media. I mean, to be to be. I think constant. Why why you're so successful at that, and why anybody is is when there's constantly updating your material. When there's constant content. Um, that's the key and I you know I definitely don't always succeed at that but I try yeah it, yeah absolutely it, it's also just becoming an expert in, in the music industry because you are because your competition if you're in Toronto isn't another band from Toronto your competition is Springsteen and Lady Gaga and Justin Bieber for the eyes and the ears of, of the audience out there so yeah so like Emily Clary said you know don't necessarily tweet about what you have for breakfast but you know tweet about what it's like to write a song tweet That's advice really that good. you can give you know so never stop really selling but you really you're, you're selling yourself so for every 10 tweets or 10 Facebook or 10 you know MySpace posts that you want to do one of them should be buy my album buy my song the rest of it is selling you selling you as a person because if I believe in you then I'll probably believe in your music <laughs>